Hello and welcome to my channel. If this is your first time here, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you can stay up to date with what's happening here on this channel. And if you already subscribed, thank you so much for tuning in today. So this week I just want to encourage you with this word. It only takes one word from God to change everything. And by everything, I mean everything. And I'm not talking about, you know, him speaking a single word to you like go or sit or do. I'm talking about him giving you a phrase, giving you a declaration over your life and over your situation that can literally change everything. And, you know, when God changes things, a lot of times he doesn't uh, change the situation, but he may help us to change our perspective in that situation. And maybe a perspective shift and a perspective change is the very thing that we need um, for things to change in our lives and so um, I just want to encourage you you know with that this week you know tune in to God listen to God listen to his voice listen for his voice this week and listen for him to give you that word that you need that's going to change everything in your situation and I just remember you know one time I was you know really struggling with some things I was dealing with some stuff and you know I was going into prayer like day after day and I was just like oh God Oh, I need your help, I need your help, and you know, just kind of whining and you know, going in and worrying my prayers basically. And, and I just remember getting to a point of you know, just repeating to myself and repeating to God, God, I trust you, God, I trust you, God, I trust you, God, I trust you. And uh, <laughs> I was in prayer one day and I just kept saying, Lord, I trust you, Lord, I trust you. And I was saying it in a way as though you know, it was like I was trying to convince myself and I'm trying to convince God. and. I just kept on repeating it, Lord, I trust you. And, you know, in a moment's time, I heard God say, well, get up and go, or get up and rest then, I think, or something like that. He said to me, like, get up and go, and uh, go in peace and rest, or something like that, he said to me. And when he said that, go and rest, you know, I was like, wow, you know, that's really all I needed to do in the first place was just rest and just trust him, you know, in the situation. It was just like, okay, if you trust me, you know, you don't need to come in here and repeat it over and over and over and over that you trust me. If you trust me, you got to put some faith, you know, behind that. You got to put some faith behind those words that you are speaking. If you really trust me, then you'll get up, you'll walk out of this closet, and you'll go in peace. You'll trust, you'll rest, you know, you'll really have faith and just go on with your life and trust that I have everything, you know, in my hands and that I'm working it out. There's been so many, you know, times in my life, you know, even just through other people praying for me, you know, sometimes my husband will, you know, pray for me and he will speak a specific word or something that's like dead on to the, you know, thing that I'm dealing with or whatever. Not that I've already spoken to him about it, but just by way of the Holy Spirit speaking through him or, you know, praying through him, he'll speak a word that would be so significant to what I was dealing with. And it was like that one word just shifted everything in me. It shifted the focus, it shifted my mindset. It, it, it turned, you know, my thoughts and turned my, you know, my direction and the way that I was thinking about everything. And it gave me the strength that I need, you know, to keep on pushing through, you know, cause like I said, sometimes God doesn't change the situation, but he'll change you in the situation. He'll help you to, you know, turn your mind around, see things from a, a different perspective. And that may be all the change that you need so you know I just pray that that's an encouragement to you I pray that you you know will begin to just learn how to practice the presence of God just learn how to be still before him and hear his voice and just know that he will speak a word he will give you a declaration he will speak a word over you or speak a word to you and it's almost like you just take wings and you know you can just fly away in the moment because there's such a freedom that comes when God speaks a specific word to us so be encouraged with that this week tune your ears to heaven tone your ear turn your ears in you know to what god is saying listen for him to give you that word of encouragement to give you that word in your situation that's going to help you uh to get through it successfully it's going to help you to get through it strong and to stand tall in him i pray this was a blessing to you and i'll catch you guys in the next video bye